Here is the rucksack. It is light, sturdy, and waterproof. The rucksack consists of a main carrying compartment, the bottom corners known as the ears of the rucksack. Other features of the rucksack are a special pocket for the map, padded shoulder straps, webbed backrest, lightweight metallic frame, and belt loop. The rucksack is so ingeniously designed that it can contain an amazing amount of material, providing each article is correctly packed and stowed in its proper place. Clothes should be rolled and preferably fastened with strings or thongs before they are stowed in the rucksack. The stoves are put in bags which are then tied at the top. They are then placed in the cooking pots to prevent contamination. Food should not be placed near stoves or fuel containers. Weight should be concentrated near the ski trooper's back, and the heaviest articles, with the exception of fuel containers, are put into the ears of the rucksack, those portions of the main rucksack compartment farthest forward on each side of the trooper's hips. The map case is placed in the flat pocket. After the heavier articles have been stored in the ears of the rucksack, the tent section and extra clothing are stowed in the remainder of the main compartment. Fuel container is placed in the large outside pocket on the rear of the rucksack. The fuel is separated from food to prevent contamination by leakage. Small articles which may be required on the trail, such as ski waxes, avalanche cord, leather thongs, and sunburn preventative, are packed in the canteen cup and stowed inside the pocket of the rucksack. Extra socks may be put in the same pocket. In addition to these articles, a toque, more socks, extra mittens, and the white camouflage gun cover are also packed in the side pockets of the rucksack. The pans are stowed in the main compartment of the rucksack. and the canteen is stuffed inside the sleeping bag. Hot drinks may be carried in the canteen as the insulation of the sleeping bag acts as would a thermos bottle in keeping the drinks hot. The sleeping bag now fills the rest of the main compartment. Following this, the white overpants, the white rucksack cover, the emergency ski repair tip, the patrol first aid kit, 
and white cotton tent rope are all packed near the top of the rucksack where they may be obtained easily while traveling. The main compartment of the rucksack is pulled together and tied. The top flap is thrown over and cinched. The pocket in which the fuel container is stored is also closed and cinched tight. The axe is hooked into the upper eyelet flap on the outside of the rucksack. And the regular issue first aid packet is attached to the lower eyelet flap beneath the axe. 